Greetings and welcome back everyone to the Wastelands of Fallout 4 where we are making our way down to this dam by the looks of it and then I'm assuming that's going to be the Sunshine Tidings co-op over yonder. Now, I seem to recall seeing some people up on this dam and they didn't immediately appear hostile. So, I'm actually uh, quite eager to go and meet them. Let's drop my gun for now. Let's not appear threatening, shall we? Though at the same time, that could leave me wide open to attack. I'm not too fond of that idea, but... Uh... Okay, let's keep walking. If they attack first, then I am free to engage. And will do so. Okay, someone's coming to say hello. It's alright, I'm, I'm not going to rush you. Hello. Move slowly forward. Greetings. I am unarmed. Well, I mean, I'm not armed right now. They, I've got basically an arsenal hanging from my belt, but a gunner conscript. Oh, <coughs> I seem to Stop possibly right have killed there. some of your people. Any civilian passing through here is required to pay a fee of 500 caps. Really? What if I don't pay? Uh, here you go. Yeah, that's not happening. Well, let's try this anyway. How about knocking some caps off the price? 400? Can you afford that? Come on. You can do better than that. I'm gonna keep pushing my luck. Come on. You can do better than that. Listen, I'm not even supposed to be talking to you. I either collect the money or shoot you dead. Which will it be? Well... You sure I can't get you to drop some more caps off the price? And what if I don't what if pay? What if I don't pay? Oh, you wanna pay. Trust me. See, I see those guns you got, and I'm just thinking, yeah, I'll just acquire more guns. Yeah, I don't think so. I don't so. think so. Sorry about this, friend. Orders are orders. Oh, now you're making me feel bad about killing you. That's just not fun. Right. Boomstick. Yeah. I think it's time you and I had a bit of a chat with these individuals. Also, since they are in a bit of a uh, better starting situation, let's go for some Psycho Cat. <coughs> One down. <coughs> and you next. Incoming grenade! That really hurts. I'd like it to stop forever. Also need now. Um, let's see. My look omelet would have been nice earlier, but I didn't eat it. Let's grab that. And we're gonna need. Let's see what we got. Mongrel meat. Do I really not have any other cooked foods? That's rather embarrassing. I guess I could eat roasted my look meat. I feel bad about wasting that though. On a sweet roll. Or two. Okay, that was cool. I seem to have hurt my head though. That's unfortunate. I have caught a case of the stupids. I really like it that you have those uh, thirst fusion shells. I really like it. I, wa I want more. Also, I'll take a stim pack. Probably going to need it. In fact, I'm fairly certain I'm going to need to use it right away. Oh no, I'm better. Apparently, it wore off pretty quickly. Look, you said sorry to me, so I, you know, I am actually sorry that I had to kill you, but uh, you did bring it on yourself, mate. I can't just go around demanding a toll from people who are vastly better armed than you. It's not how it works. I mean, if you said the Queen had made you a knight, then I would completely have understood. I mean, you would have a right to set up toll on any bridge that you currently occupy. I wouldn't have even fought you for it, even though I could have. I'd have been like, oh, well, fair enough. If the Queen saw fit to knight you, then here's your toll money. But uh, no, no, you're just common old garden thugs. Sunshine Tidings Co-op. Hello. Is anyone here? I don't want you to be alarmed. I'm just equipped for combat because someone attacked me on the way here. Hello. 
How unfortunate. I'll take that. Take that. There's another... Um, well, I was going to say Mr. Cutty, but I, I'm hoping it's not actually a Mr. Cutty. I'm hoping... Ooh, potted meat. I'll take that. I'm hoping that it's uh, another another characterful robot, much like Codsworth. Anything out here? No. How about over here? Anything in the outhouse? Bobby pins. Someone locked the outhouse door, probably. Hello. Well, you know what? I should probably go and chat with you. Free the robots! Hello! Whoa. Professor Goodfeels. Far out. Really? Far out. Far out. That is... Hmm. Professor Goodfeels, I feel you Whoa. may have been... Uh, <laughs> been sampling your own supply. Grab all of these. And then perhaps check this out. Far out. Uh indeed. Alright. We've got snare games. Bring Grave to second R's there. This to third A's. Two second A's. Ooh, that one's good. Bring and Taint have an I and an N in common. Let's try it. Likeness 2. Likeness 2. Okay, so the I and the N. Got anything else with an I and an N? Let's see. Yeah, gains. No. Oh. Okay. So they've both got something in common. The A and the I, perhaps? But then, hmm. No, this would have had three if that was true. Um, let's see, loose, tracked, trite. Guide. Trite could be it because it has the R and the I and the T and the I. But let's see if I can reset my tries first. One dead removed. Um, no, that's the wrong type of bracket. Uh, here's another one. Another dud removed. Trite isn't gone yet. I guess that is kind of good. Since that's what I'm pinning all of my uh, hopes on. Okay, and another dud gone. Any more that I can find, because I do quite need one. Trite is still there. It's looking quite likely. Oops. Oops. Okay, I'm going to put all my hopes and dreams on track. Yes. Yes! Okay. Mr. Handy Control. Truce Protocol. Just be protocols. Guard protocols. Return for maintenance protocols. Just be. Well, I, I guess that's what you are right now. Ping in Mr. Handy Unit. Broadcasting. Just B protocol. I'm gonna guess that's what it was already, though. Yeah. As much as I like that. Let's switch you to guard protocol, perhaps? Actually, let's check on the log first. Alan, we finally sprung a slave from the squares of our, uh, for our Freedom Farm co-op. In Mr. Handy from the Nardaville suburbs. The tin can wigged out trying to go back to his slave owners. Almost 
clued the fuzz onto us. So Johnny noodled it out and zonked his motivation protocols to just be. Now we call him Professor Goodfields, just digging the world as it, uh, as it be, owing nothing to nobody. Careful with his other protocols, these cans knuckle creeps if they go ape. Uh, okay. Tempted? Let's just tell it to return for maintenance. Broadcasting maintenance protocols. Returning to maintenance facility. Hester's Consumer Robotics. Ooh, I've got a new uh, map area. Okay, I'm going to tell you to do that instead. So that you don't leave. But now I've got a new location I can go to. Which is pretty cool. Unless you've already gone. Bloody hell, you are fast. Oh no, there you are. I was about to be terribly impressed. Right, what have we got in here? So you're having a guard protocol, Mr. Handy wandering around. Nice. While I'm picking doors. Probably not the best <laughs> thing. Oh, thank you. Scoundrel you. Lab X. Why am I not surprised that I'm going to be finding loads of uh, medical supplies around here? Bone saw. Okay, that's a little more than I was expecting. Right away, stim pack. Pompadour wig. Bourbon. Blood pack. Okay. Right, what else are we going to find? Oh dear. Uh, just a wrench. To be honest, I'm not even sure why I'm here. Preston just told me to come over here, so I did. But now I'm here, I'm wondering, well, what was I meant to do here when I got here? Did anyone actually need my help? Oh my lord. Really? Where are you headed? Is this going to be a common thing now? What's in that direction? I'm not sure, but you're going somewhere important, aren't you? It's got a bead for exactly the direction you're heading in. Or are you just doing a patrol, perhaps? Could be that you're just patrolling. That would be very costly in fuel, would it not? Oh, just dipped down. Continuing on your way. Big old fire over there. I mean, perhaps you're making the Commonwealth safer. Perhaps you are not. Hello. Let's go and say hello. I mean, I did just say hello, but let's go and say hello properly. Hello, hello, hello. Hello? I've got no weapon out. Greetings. But I heard scribe and a shit. <clears throat> Back off, civilian. Oh, really? That's a bit harsh. <clears throat> Military business only. Okay, well. You have a dog, so I trust you, but. Hmm. Who's this fella? <clears throat> Out of my way, wastelander. Wow, that's just rude. But unlike most people who are rude to me, you actually seem to have the means to seriously mess my day up if I got upset about it. Okay, so you're just going to kill all the bad things here. That's, you know, you're making the wasteland safe. I can see nothing specifically wrong with that. And yet, at the same time, I am given to feeling... That you're being a little bit, uh, a little bit dismissive. Like back off, Wastelander. I live here. Maybe they brought a flag. Oh, we're buggered if they did. Oh, well, as long as you don't get in my way, then I'm not going to try and kill myself on your armor. Hello. Double hollow. Oh, I've got to level up. Build an active recruitment beacon here. What? So that was it? I was just meant to come here and, and take this place? 
Oh. Okay, I, I guess. Cap stash. Lots of things. Wow. Okay. Let it stutter, leather, left, 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 leave that. Waste on survival Excellent. guide. Collect extra meat from animal kills. Very well. Another one for the magazine wreck. Okay. Well, now that we've got that level, which I was hoping for, we can drop it into this. There we go. Now that is seriously good. Well, I guess I could build a recruitment beacon, but I don't really want to stand here and, and set it all up, to be honest. Let's just have a poke around, see what we can find first. Crate there? No. What have we got up here, then? A little bed. Okay. End of the line. Really? You have any idea who you're fighting? Clearly not, otherwise you wouldn't bother, would you? I almost feel bad about what I'm about to do to your face. There we go. You derp. Ah, oh, there's your little friend, too. See if this works. Oh. Ah, good old crits being guaranteed hits. I really need to make use of that a little bit more. Double barrel shotgun. No, you can keep it. Ooh, some sort of church building, maybe? Well, I'm not done looking around the rest of this place yet. But I'm probably going to build the beacon and then just come back later when I need to do some stuff. It looks like it's got a bunch of corn growing around. Oh, it's wild corn. Never mind, we can set this up, though. Before I actually spend any time beautifying this area, I really would want to go back and uh, deal with the other farms. Wow. Mutant Slayer's studded left right arm. Reduce damage from super mutants. Okay, that's a pretty uh, impressive thing to find on a rad roach. Yeah, I'm not messing with you. There's nothing there that I want to take. Right. What's my left arm currently? No, nah, safe crackers, so... As nice as that is, not better than what I've already got. Free the robots! Indeed! You just keep being you. Anything? <laughs> Honestly, I don't actually think I want to change you. I was thinking of switching you to guard protocol, but uh, no. I think you're you're a rather delightful component of this settlement. Right, okay. Let's build this recruit. Well, actually, I'd need to scavenge loads of things before I could build a recruitment beacon, so no, we won't. But what I will do is see if I can cook something. Can I cook anything? Yes, I can. Anything else? Yes. And we're good. Okay. Well, that wasn't too bad. All things told. We've got a, a new area now where I now need to uh, build up a settlement. Check on my data. Reply, taking point. Build an active recruitment beacon. No. Troubled waters. Out of the fire. Travel to Finch Farm. Semper Invicta, Story of the Century, go to Piper's office, Road to Freedom, follow the Freedom Trail. Reunions, discuss your findings with Piper. Yeah, that's probably what I need to do, honestly. Uh, ooh. No defense, no water at Abernathy Farm. Ten Pines Bluff also has no defense. I've got a lot of places where I can set up settlements, my lord. One of these days I'm going to have to just start a settlement somewhere. Possibly at uh, Red Rocket Truck Shop, I'm thinking. Right. Well, we've got that little church to go and check out. I suppose we can do that before we wrap this episode up. You keep being happy.
And... Where are you? Just over here. Some more things over there, though, I fancy as well. Those... The fact that there was, uh, like, a burning pyre, that's probably worth exploring. Hello. I feel bad. It's okay. I feel quite bad. But, really want that meat. The Lonely Chapel. Ooh. Sounds interesting. I'll carry it flower, I'll take. Let's find out what there is to find out down here. Bunch of Brahmin. I really want to take your heads off. I'm sorry about that. Well, actually, no, I don't. You actually appear to be... Hmm. You know what you appear to be? I was going to say you appear to be um, members of the herd of this place, and that may well be the case. But you also... I'm sorry about this. You also appear to be delicious. Yonk. Damn it! Don't you dare run away! There we go. Ooh. A crow. Well, you know what? No, I'm not going to attack you. Nothing in there. You carry on doing your things. Herb flower will be useful, though. There's a few things I can do with them. Alright, well, it's time for us to pop our heads in. Hello. Combat armor. Ooh. I will take it, because I would love if I could get a uh, group together that had combat armor as their uniform. Got some good, dirty water, and wine. If I was going to hide a bomb, it would be right behind this, because there's an obvious place to look to see if any uh, loot was stashed. Federal ration stockpile. Hmm. What are we going to find down here? Hopefully something awesome. Uh, it is a dungeon. This has the distinct smell of a dungeon to it, if you ask me. Possibly the distinct smell of a death claw. Hello? Please don't be a deathclaw. I would die. There is a gun over there. Let's creep forward very softly. Okay, I can hear someone moving around. Uh, I could just go for an attack. Combat inhibitor. You know what? I would love to shoot that off because it might cause it to uh, go crazy and start attacking other people. Yeah, let, let's try and be a little bit clever about this. Fiery. I want this to turn around first. Now, can we take that off? <laughs> that was funny. See, it pays. It, it, it absolutely pays to just wait and pick your targets well. It's just a shame that I did so much damage to it in the first instance. Hello. Oh, I doubt it. Only a fucking coward hides. Such language, madam. <laughs> Okay, federal ration stockpile password. Grab all of these. Marksman's hardened automatic pipe rifle. Pocketed painted metal chest piece. Oh, yeah, some really nice stuff. See, back in the old days, when people swore like that, they just washed their mouth out with a bar of soap. Me, I'd shoot them in the face a lot of times with a shotgun. It achieves the same effect. They stop swearing. What we got over here? 
There is something that doesn't like me nearby. Uh, nothing on you that I particularly want. Right, let's check the apparel first. Right arm. Nah, I've already got it. That's a shame. I always feel a little bit bad when a, a named person jumps out at me. But they spoke very much like a raider. I'm going to assume they were very much a raider. Hmm. What lies back there, I wonder? There is definitely... Is there anyone left here? I actually doubt it, so I'm just going to go flat out and kill that one. Black Bat, this job is yours. No one else is making any sound, so... I can only imagine that they would have been cursing up a storm. Uh, okay. Nope, that's not what I wanted. I want my light. There we are. Because I couldn't quite see. Got an armor workbench. A couple of odds and sods. I will take this, and I will also take pretty much all of that. Okay. Right, well, let's go ahead and break down some of the stuff that we've got here. If I broke that down, what would I get? Just steel. So I'm going to keep it then. The metal... See, the annoying thing is that I can't make these things. Muffled studded leather right arm. If I were to modify it, take the muffled off to have no miscellaneous, would I keep the muffled? I hope so. I hope I've just got those mods now. Pocketed combat armor, left arm piece, pocketed painted metal chest piece. Uh, we'll keep those. The leather I just flat out don't need, but the rest I'll keep. And as for weapons, we'll just flat out scrap that one, don't need it. The laser pistols keeping, marksman's hardened automatic pipe rifle. Honestly, I'm I'm likely never going to give anyone a pipe rifle at this point. That, Marksman's powerful sniper rifle. Black Bat is a hunting rifle. Whereas this is a sniper rifle. Black Bat does 64. This is 77. Okay, that really does have my attention. Let's take off that bayonet. No point in having a bayonet on a sniper weapon. That just makes no sense at all. Short night vision scope, large magazine, marksman stock, long ported pow uh, barrel, power receiver. Honestly, that's a contender just for uh, Black Bat 2 straight away. Recall compensated? Yeah, we're just going to scrap you as well. Okay. We'll test out how that sniper weapon does as we move forward. Okay, what have we just found? Discovered something. Got a safe that I can uh, pick my way into. Got it. I will take all of these. You know what, I'm just going to leave the, the weapon there. I just don't need it. Oh, someone's nearby. Okay, let's move slowly then. Softly, softly. I want to go for a crit in the back of the head. What the? Oh, dear. Oops. Don't worry. Coming around or not? Damn it. I shot the darkness. This 
shotgun is so ridiculously good. Suppressed hardened piercing te Wow, okay, that one is definitely going to be broken down and made into something awesome. I might upgrade George. And, uh... Wow, they looted this place. Blood can? Uh, probably shouldn't be taking those, but okay. Yellow paint. I'm not leaving something called a blood can. It's far too curious to leave behind. Right, okay, well, there's a door over here. Don't want to go down there just yet. Let's go check this console. All right, we've got the password, so we can just lock straight in. Memo, security door control. Uh, security upgrade. In response to recent events, this facility will be operating under heightened security starting immediately. Identification must be worn at all times while on grounds. Civilians must be checked in and given temporary identification while on the premises. This includes delivery staff and vehicle operators. There will be no exceptions. Strict inventory will be taken of federal rations. Don't risk your job by taking anything home. Yes, this means you. Urgent! Potential breach! A large group of civilians has discovered the hatch leading into the old tunnels connected to this facility. Simple surveillance of this exit point is no longer adequate. A minimum of three men will be stationed at the point until we can find a way to better secure this route or seal it up entirely. Also, I do not want to hear any more complaining about our choice to build this federal storage facility into these tunnels or the struggles of the retrofit operation. The decision has been made within the approved budget and it is done. This exit point will be handled and this facility will continue to serve its purpose. Thank you for your cooperation, even if you don't want to give it. Open the doors. There we go. Can we go back? There we go. That was a really long wait there. Okay. Now, what are we going to find in here? In fact, I'm wondering. A mini nuke? Right, okay. Fair enough. I was saying, in fact, I'm wondering if uh, perhaps... I shouldn't. Uh, lead is treated and stuff. Wrap the episode up there. I think I probably should. But this this room, so tempting. <gasps> they spotted me. They didn't notice the doors opening, but they've spotted me now. Okay, we're gonna continue this in the next episode. I hope you've enjoyed this one and are enjoying the series. And look forward to any feedback you may have to offer. But until next time, do take care. <laughs>